All right, guys, I've got a video for you today. It's a video I shot the other day at the range. I did the applied performance shooting. I redid their break yourself down drill. So um, you're gonna first see is the footage of me shooting it. Um, then you'll see the POV from the GoPro. And then you'll see the clip of me breaking it down. And then you'll see the results of the uh, target. So. Hope you guys enjoy it, and I'll catch you on the next one. Take it easy. All right, here we go. Here's the breakdown of the break yourself down drill. This is the second time. All right, so first off, just as I noticed taking this, I'm way too upright in the start position. I need to be more squatting. My knees need to be bent more, and it will show that because instead of standing there taking two shots and then leaving to the next position, I need to um, be in a down position ready to push off and have my foot ready to go to get to this next position over here fairly quickly without standing, running, stopping, planting, standing up, and shooting out again. So let's uh, show this a little bit. Draw was okay. My hand um, hit the stomach, which is an okay index. Getting the gun up, no big deal. We are uh... I noticed I had this issue of like doing this right here like a spider web around my hands when coming up to the gun. So now I've been working on making sure right from the stomach you're getting a nice Judy chop up to the gun presenting out instead of kind of racing my hands out to the gun. And as you, like we see, we're running, we're running. We made our two shots and then we're getting low to run. And I'm wa this is good, though, that I'm watching where my eyes need to be to be in, be in position, but then I, I'm doing a terrible job of getting shooting while entering the position. I could have been, gun if the gun was up, I could have been firing into the position and saving a hell of a lot of time instead of getting into the position and then shooting, stopping, and then running again over here to the last position. So there's that. There's a lot of this in this problem. It's... After taking this Tim Heron class, it's proved to me you want to be shooting as you're entering and shooting as you're leaving instead of waiting to shoot and then make the run. You save a lot of time from running with your transition between last shot to first shot if you're shooting as you're leaving and shooting as you're entering. I mean, this was a decently low position. I would have preferred lower and my arms to be not as extended here, and um, we would have so many issues, but... Like I said, there's a lot to work on here. I notice I'm upright too much. If I was down a little bit farther, it wouldn't be so bad. All right, after shooting the drill, got a really close Charlie and an Alpha, two Alpha, Alpha Mike. So this is no good, but we had a time of, oh, fuck. It said 918 until I freaking take it off my pocket. But yeah, 918. So it was an okay one. We'll try it again next week.